Hey guys, welcome back to Stacey Goes Outside. If you're new here, welcome. I create fishing videos and I post content at least once a week. So if fishing is your jam, make sure that you subscribe to my channel. So this weekend I'm in Fort Worth for the 51st annual Bassmaster Classic. We were in Birmingham, Alabama last year, back in March for the 50th anniversary. And then as you know, a week later, the whole freaking country shut down. So it was kind of like the last big gathering that I got to go to before all of that happened. So super excited. Don't know what to expect. I mean, in California, everything's still shut down, but I don't see any masks here. We're just gonna take it all in and let's go into the first day of the Outdoors Expo. Rolling motor. guys. We're out here at the stockyards at the Berkeley booth. Let's see what we get. Jerk babe. trying to stay back off those fish when the lakes get low and water gets really clear and a lot of pressure you know the, the further you can stay from your target your distance you notice know, the depth finders i think is making a lot of noise spooking a lot of fish further back to the thanks for having me on all right yeah. hey there
15 pounds even to take the lead. 19 pounds. Thursday with 37 pounds, 14 ounces, looking for 11, 4, 13 pounds! All right, guys, so the 2021 Bassmaster Classic here in Fort Worth is a wrap. Hank Cherry went back to back, and I just realized something. I've only been to two Bassmaster Classics, and he's won both. So maybe I need to reach out to him and tell him that he needs to put me on the payroll. We're going to go get some barbecue and enjoy the city. guys it's Monday I'm back home in California and before I wrap up this video I just want to show you what we hauled home from the classic so if you do plan to attend the classic know that there are just a ton of giveaways a ton of great deals and you will be bringing home stuff if it's local wear a backpack you can haul all your stuff home easily we flew in from California so what I've learned over the years when attending these big events is pack an empty duffel bag because after three days, we collected this duffel bag full of stuff. And as you can tell, I could fit in here if I needed to. We always fly Southwest and they don't charge for a second bag to check in, so it's perfect. So right now I'm gonna unpack this and show you all the stuff that we brought home. Finally, that's everything. All right, guys, so let's take a closer look at everything. We've got some great Spro duffel bags. I didn't do a good job of propping those up, but we've got a couple of those. Bunch of different t-shirts, shark-shaped sidewalk chalk for the kids, toys, rod covers, key holders, cleaners, hot sauce somehow, I forgot about that, laundry detergent, Plano box, I've got a new pink hat. Thank you, Daiwa. Free baits, hooks, masks, buffs, koozies. Here are the Berkeley baits that we won from the vending machine. And then in this little tiny corner, I mean, out of all of this, these are the only items that we purchase. So on that one booth, these dredgers, which are becoming my favorite crankbaits, those were two for $8.99. Got a great deal on this Whopper Plopper. And then I found a couple of scum frogs for three bucks each, so not a bad haul. You know, whether you're a professional angler, a weekend angler, or just someone who watches fishing on TV, you've got to go to the Classic at least once. It's definitely a bucket list event, and I guarantee that you're going to have a blast. If you enjoy this video, make sure that you give it a thumbs up. Go ahead and hit that subscribe button because now that the country is opening back up, I'm going to be attending a lot more of these events around the country and I'll be sure to share all my experiences with you guys. Comment below or send me a message on Facebook or send me a message through Instagram and let me know where you think I should fish. Let me know which events you think I should attend. And who knows, maybe when I'm at the Bassmaster Classic next year, which is scheduled to be at Lake Hartwell in South Carolina, I'll see you outside.